What you need to know about black holes. Hey everyone, it's Alexa again, and welcome back to another video. Black holes, the topic of many a late night debate and breakup. Some people believe that these holes are just a fabricated myth, but these people have also been teased as being flat earthers. Black holes are like giant garbage disposals, except we're not really sure where all that garbage goes. What goes in very rarely comes out. They are dark, invisible to the naked eye, and leave much to speculation. But before we get into today's video, make sure that you're subscribed and ring the bell so that you never miss any of our upcoming videos. Who, what, when, where, why? So many questions about black holes and so little information to go by. Black holes are formed when a star can no longer sustain itself. It collapses under its own gravity. Sometimes these stars become white dwarfs or neutron stars, but sometimes they can form black holes. Black holes can continue growing as they continue absorbing more mass around them. The gravitational pull of a black hole is so strong that even light cannot escape getting sucked in another universe. It's not 100% proven. However, the quantum theory suggests that inside each black hole is an entirely new universe. A lot like the rabbit hole in Alice in Wonderland. Some believe that if we were to survive entering the black hole, we'd enter another dimension or an alternate reality. Closer to home. It's easy to wonder if black holes are dangerous to us here on Earth, and scientists believe that our Milky Way has a black hole of its own. Although, don't panic, the chances of being swallowed are very low. Another possibility. New research suggests that most galaxies have a massive black hole at their center, with hundreds of solar systems surrounding them. The one in the Milky Way that we just mentioned is thought to be 30 million times the mass of our Sun. Time travel. Black holes don't give a hoot about time and space, and with its strong gravitational pull, it would slow down time and warp space. Some believe that this could be the key to making time travel a possibility. Using Einstein's general theory of relativity, any object that is as huge as a black hole can distort the space around it, including the Sun and Earth. Comfort food. What would happen to you if you were sucked into a black hole? Firstly, there'd be no way of escape. Your life would flash before your eyes and your body would be stretched like an elastic band. The term is called spaghettified, or the noodle effect. In astrophysics, it refers to an object being stretched vertically into the horizontal compression into long, thin shapes. Imagine a body going through that. It's not pleasant. All shapes and sizes. Black holes come in all shapes and sizes, from middling-sized holes to supermassive ones. The most common black hole is the middling-sized one, which is formed when a star dies or a supernova explodes. Then, whatever remains collapses under the weight of its own gravity. Scientists claim that these black holes are not actually holes, but points of highly compacted matter with gravitational footprints. These usually weigh between 5 and 10 times more than our sun. Then there's the supermassive black hole, and they are the biggest in the universe. Some weigh billions of times more than the sun. There's thought to be one at the center of every galaxy. Size counts. One of the biggest black holes that we know of is Sagittarius A, the one that is believed to be at the center of the Milky Way. This hole has a mass of roughly 4 million suns. Paint it black. Some like to speculate that our universe exists inside a black hole. Some researchers have gone further to add that should we discover a way to access a black hole, traveling through it should not hurt at all, and we would enjoy the ride took a while. Black holes have probably been there since the beginning of time, but we only discovered the first one during the 1960s, and we can thank X-ray astronomy for that. Cygnus X-1 was found during balloon flights, but it wasn't properly identified until 10 years later. To infinity and beyond. There are said to be so many black holes, we wouldn't be able to count them all. It's believed that in the Milky Way, there are over 100 million stellar mass black holes. With all the billions of galaxies out there, you can only imagine why it's impossible to count them. Beware the bite. Black holes are considered the deadliest force in the universe, and that's because anything coming in close contact with these beasts would be devoured instantly. And by close contact, we're not referring to a few miles or kilometers, but within a few billion of each. The Big Freeze If you were able to observe the happenings in and around the black hole, you'd notice that objects that go close to a black hole appear to freeze or slow down significantly. This has to do with the light signals taking longer to escape the gravitational pull, and those light signals don't reach us for a very long time. The light becomes redshifted as time goes by, and the wavelengths increase in size, eventually turning into infrared radiation and then radio waves. 
too close for comfort. The nearest black hole is fortunately not that close, but rather 1,600 light years away. You might think that's a bit too close, but it's not considered dangerous at all. Other studies disagree and believe it to be 20,000 light years away. We're gonna side with other studies. Spitballs. You've heard how destructive these holes can be because they gobble up everything that comes close to them, but here's more disconcerting news. Black holes also spit things out, and they can be the size of planets called spitballs. They're made up of matter that has been swallowed and coagulates into chunks and gets released at 20 million miles per hour. 10-year feast. Scientists have been observing a massive black hole swallowing up a star for the past 10 years, officially the longest black hole meal ever recorded. Either the star is huge or it's being consumed completely. They've been using three sources to keep an eye on this, NASA's Chandra X-ray Observatory and Swift Satellite and the European Space Agency's XM M. Newton Craft. Large and in charge. The largest black hole that we know of is 12 billion times larger than our sun. This was discovered in 2015 and has a name that involves around 15 letters and numbers. The hole is estimated to be 13 billion years old and is said to be the most luminous in the universe. It's 429 trillion times brighter than the sun, and scientists are hoping to make use of this light to research the darkest corners of the universe. Much of a muchness. Despite our reports on how the black hole is so great at sucking things in, the gravitational pull of a black hole is the same as any other gravitational pull in space. For example, if the sun was a black hole of equal mass, then Earth would still experience the same gravitational pull as before. It doesn't change. It's only when objects are close would one be aware of the stronger gravitational force. Real or fantasy? Scientists are still speculating whether wormholes exist through the black hole. A wormhole is a theoretical passage creating shortcuts throughout the universe. If wormholes did exist, it could bring high levels of radiation, a collapse, or dangerous contact with matter that we're just not familiar with. There are a few who believe that the black hole can transport us to different parts of the universe, but I doubt we'll ever know for sure in this lifetime. A day in the history books. April the 10th was a huge day for black holes, as it was the first time a legitimate photo of a black hole came to be, and we can credit 29-year-old Dr. Katie Bowman for it. She developed the algorithm which brought forward the first ever image of a black hole. The image was captured by the Event Horizon Telescope, which is a network of eight linked telescopes. She has said that there was a melting pot of great minds putting this together, including astronomers, physicists, mathematicians, and engineers. Back in the day, you'd think that the information about black holes in our universe would be recent, but John Mitchell developed the theory in 1783 already. Shortly thereafter, Pierre-Simon Laplace also came up with the concept of dark stars in 1796. The term frozen star was later coined to describe the last phase of the star shutting down and collapsing. It wasn't until the 20th century that the phrase black hole was coined by John Wheeler, as the hole would absorb all the light surrounding it. A little science fiction. There are many science fiction movies that have featured the ominous black hole. One of the movies that has so many people puzzled is Interstellar. The concept of event horizons are looked at, where no light or other radiation can escape, and once you enter, there is a point of no return. Other movies include Battlestar Galactica, Stargate SG-1, Lost in Space, and The Theory of Everything. Moving down south. In South Africa, astronomers have stumbled across a part in space where massive black holes from different galaxies are all facing the same direction. Their gas emissions are getting out as if they were synchronized. Scientists are finding it hard to explain why black holes that are 300 million light years apart are acting in unison. Dynamite comes in small packages. One of the smallest black holes is the IGR J1709136624, and this tiny hole can rip winds out at 20 million miles per hour, 10 times stronger than the biggest of black holes. This black hole is found in our Milky Way. But the absolute smallest black hole that we know of is the XTE J1650500. It has a mass of 3.8 solar masses and is 15 miles in diameter. Where good holes go to die. Black holes do have a timeline, and over time they do disappear or evaporate. They radiate a small number of photon particles, meaning the black hole does lose mass. It's called Hawking radiation, whereby the hole will shrink. The process is mind-blowingly slow and could take billions of years to do, so it'll never happen in my lifetime. Fine dining. Black holes can eat each other, a new effect to astrophysicists called merging galaxies. One black hole, 39 times the mass of the sun, and another, 19 times the mass of the sun, produced a black hole that was 49 times the mass of the sun when the smaller one was eaten by the larger one. 
Before we get to number one, we know it's big news, so we've got to ask, what is your take on the latest image of a real black hole? Share your thoughts with us in the comments below. On the move. Rogue black holes would be a problem for us here on Earth purely because they are so unpredictable. It was always assumed that black holes were stationary, but in March 2017, the Hubble telescope picked up a rogue black hole exiting Galaxy 3 C186 at 5 million miles an hour. At this speed, the hole could travel between Earth and the Moon in under three minutes. 